Here is a view of your course homepage. Keep in mind, instructors can organize the course homepage in many different ways, and this course might not look exactly the same as yours. And that's okay. The general layout and core features you see here should mostly be the same. At the top of the course home, you will see a course introduction from your instructor. The course introduction is a way for your instructor to welcome you to the class and provide a brief overview of the course. The activity tab displays the course share stream. Your course share stream shows all social interaction within the current course from your classmates and instructor. The articles tab is basically your RSS feed for the course. It's an optional feature, so if you don't see it in your course homepage, your instructor might not have chosen to turn it on for the course. But if it is available to you, be sure to check it out. You'll find many helpful websites listed here relevant to what you are learning. Another course home feature you will use often is announcements. Announcements is where your instructor communicates important course events and exam dates. After you read an announcement, you have the option to mark it as unread. Some students find this helpful when they don't want to forget an exam is coming up and prefer to see the announcement as a daily reminder to prepare. Click the red and unread buttons to filter announcements by what you have read and not read. Upcoming shows your currently scheduled assignments, discussions, or exams that are coming up in the next seven days. This particular feature is especially helpful when you're enrolled in multiple courses and can use a quick glimpse of what's coming up so you can plan your week accordingly. Now that we've covered the essential functions of the course homepage, you might be thinking, well, this is great, but how do I get to my assignments and exams? The course menu contains the main content of your course. How our course menu is structured here might look differently than how it is structured in your course. Keep in mind, Many instructors have different approaches to how they organize their courses. For example, your course may be organized into modules or weeks. The important thing to understand is that the course menu is divided into sections that you will complete one at a time. Click any section to expand and see the items for that section. If I expand week one and select discussion one, we can see the topic for discussion one is to introduce ourselves in the threaded discussion board. If we look under Course Tools and click Syllabus, we can see what we'll be learning. Click Gradebook, and this is where we will see our grades. Once you navigate away from Course Home, simply click Course Home in the Course Menu to return to the Course Home page. We covered a lot here on how you can navigate the Course Home. So just to recap, remember, the Course Home page is the home page to your course where you'll see important announcements and social activity in the course share stream. The course menu is the course navigation system where assignments, gradebook, exams, and other essential course tools can all be found. Throughout this video series, we interchange between two different course layouts just to give you a sense of how a course can be arranged differently, but the tools and the features all remain the same.